Welcome to This Is Important, a production of iHeartRadio, the show where we talk about what's obviously most critically, crucially important. Today on This Is Important. And this dude's like, wow, I'm like really knowledgeable about the vagina. I can just remember the parts very well. Fuck you, I smoke weed. I smoke cigarettes, I've been smoking for years, I'm Kyle. If I was a woman, I wouldn't be a big titted woman. I'd be a big ass woman. I ain't putting on a brassiere. It's not happening. Strap in. Hey! Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Happy, you guys happy. Want some cookies. Joy, joy. Pew, pew, pew. Yeah. Oh. Kyle? Kyle? Hey, what no. are you smoking? Oh, Did you oh, just man. fucking rip it, dude? Smoking. He, he just shit. ripped an air bong and didn't make the noise. I, what do you mean? Yes, I did. I made the noise. I didn't hear it. Did you guys hear I it? Did, I, did, wait, I didn't yeah. hear it. Let's wait, hear it. Is there like a like air bong, like air guitar championships? There should be. I feel like in weed culture, they Let's see if Kyle everything. would be on it. Let's hear it. Do you not hear that? You don't hear that? No. Uh-uh. You, we don't. No, we I definitely don't hear, don't hear that. No. Yeah. It's coming in. Okay, hold on. Let me turn up the dial, I guess, because I'm fucking doing it. <laughs> yeah, turn up the dial, because I want to hear you air rip it, Kyle. We've done it before. Let's see if you've improved. Yeah, let's let's hear it. Let's hear it. Let's hear it, Kyle. Oh, it's <laughs> okay. a slight one. It's a baby. It's a baby uh-huh. rip. Okay. Smoke weed every day. Oh, <laughs> oh <laughs> shit. I cannot believe you can't hear that. Hey, slide in Kyle's DMs with your uh, with your no. air bong rip videos and send them to Kyle. We'll pick one and give you a mention in the retweets. Yeah, okay. and, I mean those were loud. If those were not like loud, just turn them up, Todd. You know what I mean? Turn them up real yeah. quick. Crank that shit yeah, blast, up. Blast yeah, because they were loud over here. Mm, don't tell shit. don't tell Todd what to do. Well, let's. But, hey, Kyle, do one more. That way, Todd won't. Why do I have to do it again? I don't want to do it again. I don't want to do it anymore. <laughs> now he's shouting. Well, we want we oh, want now you people can hear to know me. how quiet it was for us and how we couldn't hear it. And then now Todd's going to turn this one up, and I wanted them to to hear. Oh, it. okay. Here we go. Right, Here we go. Rip, dog. Since it's freaking see ya. It's all in post. Isn't he just gonna yeah, do, it, do it later? Oh boy, what happened? Oh, that was a, that was uh, a little better at first. Damn, we're yeah, coming on I fire think, today. Think, <laughs> he just choked. He just choked. Why do you always say coming on fire? Oh he boy, look at this cat. Choked. <laughs> <laughs> Choking. It's everywhere. It's everywhere. It's on the microphone. I have green tea on my whole fucking setup right now. Yeah, yolk on your face. <laughs> Damn, bro. <laughs> I saw your life flash before your eyes. That shit caught a tube or something. Um, I don't know what the <laughs> fuck happened. <laughs> I'm sorry I did that to you. I kind of I kind of pressured you into that one. That's I knew I didn't want to go again. You're right, but you know what, Adam? That's what happens. You hey, can dude, pressure just... me into doing things, and then I do them, and sometimes I get hurt. <laughs> and other times you have a great time. So right, yeah. right. But yeah. it's like when we were roommates, and you used to say, "Come on, let's go to Vegas. Let's go to Vegas." Yeah. Vegas. Vegas. Mm. And I had no money in my ATM. Yeah. Well, none of us did. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Card or in my account. And then the end, no, right. you end up leaving with like fucking six overdrafts. And, nice. and I'm in the hole even harder, you but, know? But the life experience. <laughs> Do you remember those overdrafts as much as you remember us being the party police? I, I do. Being blackout yeah, drunk. The, the anguish. Yeah, yeah. I mean, to a point, I remember our times together in Vegas. Yes. But there more is more a... than those overdraft fees. How much do you think you rack, <laughs> right. racked up in overdraft fees? Oh, in I what? just overdrafted yesterday. <laughs> I what? Up. Hey, yeah. Just give hey. me a call, man. We, we'll talk. We'll have my guy send some money hey, here. Hey, Blake, we have the same business manager. What's going on there? Is he <laughs> dropping the ball for you? Do we got a Yeah, call? but I have a little secret, like, little Wells Fargo account that I go to and overdraft when I want to feel, you know, that feeling again. Okay. Ah, this okay, is bizarre. Let's go. Okay, let's go. <laughs> what did you overdraft on? It, it has to be Sunday. When you overdraft, you want it to be something cool where you're just like, you know what? Fuck it. I just bought right. a, a fur pinball yeah. machine. Right. Yeah. right. <laughs> or yeah. something, something a fur pinball ex- machine. Yes. A fur pinball machine. <laughs> yeah, mine's just like I got the house cleaner. Just cast a check when I didn't expect it to happen. <laughs> oh. What has happened? But also, yeah. like, how much 
you should have in your like yeah. I have like my checking account that just has like a few G's and then there's like the other oh, geez, one that dude. I've never even touched, Whoa. right? Okay. So what's going on with your little This is actually the Wells my very, very, very first bank account that I ever opened in Concord, California. Okay, we get it. We get it. I I have the same thing as well. It was okay. my college uh, I opened it when I was 18 when I first moved to California in my Wells Fargo. I also, it has a place in my heart because I mm -hmm. love Wells Fargo. Mm -hmm. Me uh, too. I love that they are known for ripping people off. <laughs> Extremely <and> known. <laughs> class yeah. action lawsuits. Hey, they got big titty tellers too. They got some big titty tellers Do too. They? Dude, Do they? Are you it's still going to the bank? Okay, let's go. Holy mackerel. I know they did in Van Nuys. <laughs> this is true. Dude, when we had workaholics and I would go cash those big, big checks in Van Nuys, those, yeah. those first workaholic ones. Uh-huh. Dang, uh -huh. those big titty tellers were like, what's up? What are, what are you working on? I, admittedly, I remember that exact same thing. <laughs> I went in. We might have gone in together excited to cash our checks. And yeah. I, remember, I remember those big titty tellers <laughs> being like, uh, yo, what's up? Yeah. Like, because we've been going in catching like, Four hundred dollar checks. Yeah, no, we we were coming in there to mm -hmm. ca to cash in quarter rolls, and they're like, yeah, "Okay, yeah. here come these Bl guys." Blake uh -huh. used Blake used to count his literally count nickels, and then take in a, a little sack of nickels and Had get to. like twenty three dollars. Oh hell yeah, dude! Uh, which is a lot of nickels, turns out. It is. And and then <sighs> we went in and cashed a check for like I don't know. Eight thousand yeah, dollars. Yeah, browsing that fucking blue, blue. The and, 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 and both of them <laughs> said mail browsing. order comedy on them. They're like, "What's this little startup company?" Ooh, yeah. yeah. Hello. Hey, take Hello. a guess. Why don't you take a guess? Take huh? a guess. What do you think those, it is? Those hey. big titty tellers looked at us and were like, "We work." Yeah, baby. Yeah. I, yeah. I think it's the uniforms because I do remember going to the one over on Fairfax and mm -hmm. Beverly right there. Mm hmm. And I don't know if the titties were big or if it's what, the, but some they're it's a it's a problem. Now, do we? I, I think <laughs> it's a this, problem. I don't know where to swipe my ATM card. Oh wow! Holy mackerel! Wells Fargo has done shady stuff in the past, right? Have they? So do we think? Yeah, they're they were like they were, uh, like. Uh, Are they overdrafting my shit? They were they were they were opening accounts for people. Uh, without their like full knowledge of right. opening accounts, right. and then oh, they yeah. would cure charges because it had oh, no money in for, it. I think they did it for me, honestly. I think I had one that oh, was yeah. open that I was like, "Huh?" They did it for like thousands of people. It's <laughs> like a huge class action uh, lawsuit against them. And I'm saying that like I know right. what the fuck it is, but Wall Street Journal uh, for sure, dude. I'm impressed, bro. I'm hell of impressed at your knowledge yeah, of Wells. This is the Wolf of Wall Street out of our friend group. <laughs> yeah, yeah, man, that's me. And uh, so maybe they do other shady shit like only hiring big titted tellers. Dude, that I believe could also it. be like. And is that shady? Like someone at the top is like a little bit of a, a well, creep. Don't, no, not, I don't know, shady or cool. Who knows? But it's the also, I would say it's shady. It's perspective. It's Wells just, Hooters. What lens are you looking through, you know? If I was a woman, I wouldn't be a big titted woman. I'd be a big assed woman. Yeah, you, you don't think you don't have think uh, cans? They all work at. USAA <laughs> great ass. How can you know? How can you know? God, you don't I think you'd have a good rap that. if you were a well, girl? You look at, I, you look sure. at the women in your family. I yeah, yeah. I look at the women. In Is that? But yeah, but aren't don't boobs very? Yeah, I think or, that moves. I think that changes. <laughs> uh, no, just speaking for myself, I would be uh, up top two bee stings. That's what mm -hmm. I would be. Mm-hmm. And down bottom. Okay. <laughs> th three three G strings. Your boobs are huge. Dude, I, I know as, for a fact it's beasting. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I know for a fact I'd be stacked. Yeah, you would well, Your no, boobs you would have huge. big old titties, but no ass. You'd be like you'd be No, Kyle's no. boobs would a hang funny. so low though. Right. Kyle's well that's because I'm not wearing a bra. Hang. That's because I ain't wearing a bra, bro. Yeah, yeah. yeah. No. <laughs> you're free you you're free in the nipple. You're part hey, of the cool. free the nipple movement. Only on special occasions. Yeah. Special occasions, all right? That's what's up. There we go. <laughs> and Durs has boobs. Yeah, that's why I'm not <laughs> <boobs. laughs> <laughs> in yet. I'm just like, <laughs> these are all hypotheticals. I'm living the life here. Your boobs are huge. <laughs> Durs is wearing a bra right now. I mean, not for nothing, though. The guys who worked at Wells Fargo were pretty freaking put together as well, man. The hair gel on the dudes. <laughs> yeah. Dude, hard hair. The haircuts. They get haircuts every week for sure. The hard hair. 
Oh, yeah. With like smart glasses where they're like, uh, I can actually help you over here. And you're like, I'm going to mm -hmm. her, dude. <laughs> there's a creep. There's a creep at the top on the Wells Fargo pyramid who's just mm -hmm. only picking hotties with bodies to work yeah. at the Fargo. It's, it's the like same Abercrombie. Who, Abercrombie. Yeah. And this went back to the stagecoach. You know, they wanted <laughs> yeah. some hot pieces of ass on that stage. Yeah, coach. you can ride, you can ride. Or, you yeah, can walk, you can't. You can yeah. walk, baby. <laughs> he looked at the Kyle girl and was like, you can walk. Uh, no, <laughs> no, they didn't. <laughs> no, they didn't. <laughs> no, they didn't. No, they didn't. No, they didn't. His fake girl. No, I heard what you said and I disagree. Kyle's great, great, great grandma knew a check and said, you're walking, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Wow, God! Water trash. That's how Ch that's how Chase Bank started because she was chasing after, and then she was like, "Chase, my own bank. I'm going back to the river." Water trash. I ain't putting on a brazier. It's not happening. Look, girl, you're not getting to here. You could you could chase us, but okay, you know what? I'm gonna start my own bank. I'm going back to the river. She definitely lives down by the river. Dude, uh, Chase yeah. Bank. Water trash. <laughs> That's great. Hey, how about how about how they have those banks and churches? What's up with like the first third bank of whatever? Mm. Or like the first seventh Baptist? Like, w w I don't understand that shit. <laughs> Wait, what is this now? Hold on. I'm in, not... in banks and churches, mm -hmm. for some reason, yeah. there will be like the first third bank of the Pacific Northwest or oh, mm -hmm. the, the first, first third bank. I, dude, I'm just saying. It's out there. Is I'm that like, a thing? I don't know. I don't know if I know. Blake, please jump in. You're you're non yes. <laughs> it sounds familiar. It sounds familiar. I'm not catching the the grounding element here. You've never seen like a sign for a church that's like the second, third Presbyterian, whatever, and you're like, huh? <laughs> well, I think there's like Seventh Day Adventists or something like that. Seventh Day Baptists, uh -huh. maybe there's like or something like that, right? I like how you're calling me out, and then you add that to well, the party. Seventh Day, I believe, is like. A reference to that, the Bible, those right? Are, like those are uh, Mormons. So, yeah, those are Mormons. The the Joseph Smith followers. Yes. Mm. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Because like on the seventh day, they found like the plates that Joseph Smith wrote or something. Let's go, Brandon. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go, Brandon. <laughs> 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 uh, I remember some of Mormon uh, lore and legacy, but I know like. Like Joseph Smith, like found some like gold plates. <laughs> religious people love when, when you call their uh, when you refer to their religion as lore. <laughs> yes, as lore and legend. Right. Yeah. yeah. Well, yeah, I so the lore and legend states uh, on the third day he rose <laughs> the again myth and the mythology. I only know because uh, Mormon churches always have really sick uh indoor basketball courts so that's where we would run yo they stay having indoor basketball yo, courts <laughs> very true they all have one dude mormons can ball dude well is it because we is it because they didn't though. why 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 well, do we, they all they all have basketball to recruit courts. children to calm them into giving their money when they're yeah. grown-ups and then having their children con them it's science and and also where durs and i are from Condom? they're giving they, it's they're, they're, <laughs> <laughs> giving it to the ward. It's cold. That's it's right. Cold. It's because it's cold, Kyle. It's cold. Right. Like because oh. I went to. Uh, I mean, you're my cold, your basketball players. Oh, mm -hmm. okay. <laughs> my Catholic uh, elementary school. When I was a kid, I went to a Catholic elementary school. It had a shitty. It was like a shitty school, like yeah, but... really shitty. But it had an indoor basketball court, and the and the ceilings. Yeah, but that school, that school, we're talking church. The ceilings were twelve feet high. You would you would yeah. constantly yeah. be throwing the the basketball into the ceiling. Adams, all school, every school, every school has a basketball court. Adam. I would venture to say every Adam. every school. Yeah, but it's also a church. Every school has one, Adam. <laughs> <laughs> but it's also a church. Water trash. Right, but they built the the basketball thing to have the school to trade the children to get the money. <laughs> yes, there's ways to get That's kids true. in. That's true. True. Yeah. Like our our uh, church would have video game night, and then every kid right. would come over and play James uh, 007 Golden Eye right. until their eyes bled, and then once it got around midnight, they'd start pumping in you know the messages. The lock in. <laughs> oh, you can't go anywhere now, kids. Guess what? Jesus is watching you sleep. You can't go anywhere. Dude. So they would let you play like violent video games? He's gonna watch me J.O. Yeah, they would have video game night. You could do whatever. You could play the games. And yeah. J.O. Uh, yeah. There so 
Wait, so you guys both mentioned J-No. <laughs> I, I want to get into that. <laughs> J-No. Uh, uh, okay. Jesus and other guys. No, you know what it was? It it was a um 24-hour like fast, but also a video game night. Because I think like Nintendo 64 just dropped. So they were like, yo, these kids can play like four-player. I did that. I, Blake, we did... You think these graphics are fast? How about we fast for 24 hours? We did that together, didn't we? And it was actually hella hard and like to not eat for 24 hours. <laughs> we got it so hungry. So fucking hard. We got so hungry. We were like delusional. But to, to listen, this is the whole thing. They starve you for yeah. 24 hours and then they go, guess what, guys? So you're delusional. We're going to give you food and you're gonna be like, oh, this is the best sensation ever. I'm going to remember here at church, take my money. <laughs> this is the body of Christ you're eating. No, that's what the fucking weird part was. When it all ended, they like gave us tortillas and like just baked beans. It was like, what the fuck is this? You remember this? the meal? Wow. Dude, I do because I'm like, Ortega. this meal... <laughs> this meal is about to be cracking, and they just served up tortillas and baked beans. Well, why why do this with children? I thought the whole thing mm. with children is they have to be nourished. Well, we were teenagers. We were teenagers. Yeah, th right. that, that's we, children. We were like like probably what it's 13 science. or 14 or something like that. 12. Very much children still. Okay. Yeah, that's still youthful energy. That's but that's mad right. youthful right there. 13. Yeah. What is the purpose of it? Why do you not eat? Because you're like, what's up, dude? Fuck you. I smoke weed. I smoke cigarettes. I've been smoking them for years. I'm Kyle. <laughs> yeah, you better believe it. Yeah, Kyle was definitely token. Hey, what's up? It's me, Kyle. I am Blake. That was hell the hard part about the fast, too, is they would lock you in, and I'd have to, and I would not know how I would go fucking smoke. I, I, I would have to sneak out to go smoke. That was hella hard. You reminded I, me of that. Right. And yeah. then there'd be another Jesus guy out there smoking to be like, Secret it's all safe. Planned. Yeah, he goes. It's okay, man. We can smoke yeah. together. You know what's what's really smoking? This book, the Bible. Thank you, God. <laughs> it's true. That definitely goes down. They're like, I won't tell. And he's definitely doing uh, like Ace Ventura, the mask impressions uh -huh. when he's saying, uh, "You know what else is smoking?" smoking. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that okay. hooks him. Hey, this will hook him. Hey, and you're like, oh, we want to get them thinking about yeah. the Lord and getting their money. This will hook them. Do it. Man. <laughs> Somebody stop me from reading another verse of the Bible. You can't do it. You can't do it. So back to the Jane and Owen. <laughs> no. uh, the Jane and the Owen. <laughs> what about no! it? Which part? Did you guys? Did you guys? We were doing so good on this uh, sleepover. Mm -hmm. Were you guys Jane and Owen in your? Uh, in your sleeping bags? I don't think it got to that point, actually. Well, when did it? When did it not? I mean, that's the thing. Okay, like, here we go. Yep. <laughs> like you're telling us point. the ridge uh -huh. wasn't out. <laughs> yeah, but I remember it was co-ed. I think it was. I think it was co-ed, and I think there was some it, some chicks that we were digging on too. Oh, yeah. They it always was to lure you in. You were like, "Cool, I'm gonna yes. sleep over with girls," and they go, and then like. At midnight, they go, girls, we're locking you all in here. Boys, you're going to be all in here jacking off together. <laughs> <laughs> right, right. But I think it was like you would you would like connect and be like, okay, meet me in this secret hallway with a girl at this time. And then you would go like yeah. kiss. And then you never did. No, I, re I think you'd go kiss. <laughs> Wait, you think Water or trash. you remember? <laughs> Not after the lockdown, though. No, you'd go kiss. You would kiss. This is what, what? happened at church, bro. How are you pronouncing it? Kiss. Did this happen? <laughs> yeah, did this happen, Kyle? Or are you making it up? Did this happen or are you making it up? No, this is this happened. This is this okay. is somebody? what went down. Yeah, I kissed somebody. Right, so okay, so it seems like a made up story. <laughs> no, it was a girl. It was on the other side. It seems like a made up story right now. It's a girl we had to meet in the hallway. Oh, yeah. Remember? Okay. The hallway. There's no hallways in church. I'm kind of remembering this because you know how Kyle isn't really a gamer because I was fully just golden eye. I right. had no other vision other than <laughs> I'm horrible. I'm horrible at that shit too. I need more goldfish to eat stat. I'm like no being odd job that's cheating <laughs> and then Kyle's out yeah. in the hallway True. by the I think it was by like the water fountain. I snuck in a jolt cola. I'm never going to sleep. You would sneak out and like go smoke ciggies. It's all comes back yeah. to that because these girls like smoking ciggies too. Kyle was the bad boy. Dude, Kyle's like smoking, fucking giving out tattoos to people. <laughs> I'm playing Mario Kart. Yeah, throwing, throwing his you head like C all about. <laughs>
do acid and like kill homeless people. <laughs> yeah. Right? This was a church thing, right? This is what you did at those things. We all we all mature at different ages, okay? Mm, that's mature for you. True that. Yeah, you were definitely all about that. I I was horrible at at Goldeneye. I, I was I was a late bloomer too, Blake. Yeah. I, I'm glad I had those years. Yeah. I think we were you had those pretty days. far apart. What did you say? Oh, I thought you said fears. <laughs> yeah, oh, I'm glad I feared women. <laughs> Yeah, I'm glad I fear women. Uh, healthy fear of women. That's not gonna manifest in a weird way later. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Very psychedelic. I love it, baby. Yeah, baby. Yeah. Hey, oh I remember th- th- those sleepaway camps, like uh, uh, church lock-ins and stuff, were always the horniest places in the goddamn world. I'm telling you, dude, this is real. Adam, I got a weird feeling that wherever <laughs> you were, it was pretty horny. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> you know. Yeah, but I was, I was much like Blake. I was much like Blake, where I, even though I was, I wanted to. Yeah, chop chop up the girls. I also <laughs> was chop up. <laughs> what? Yeah. Wait, wait, chop what? With a healthy chop. fear of me. <laughs> On to chop burn, burn them. Uh-huh. <laughs> Holy chop. mackerel! Did you mean chop, chop it, it up? up? Like Dude. chat, chop chat it up. First, chat, chat with them. First, I shave them. <laughs> <laughs> then I lick their bodies completely and chop I them up. Oh. Yeah, I wanted to chop up girls too. Instead, I, I chopped up <laughs> small <laughs> rodents. Yes. <laughs> we used to eat mice tails for sure. We all know this. Yeah, we dissected the neighbor's cat. <laughs> we kept it as alive as long as possible. Uh-huh. Uh, so you so, wanted to yes, chop up girls just, just like me? To, yeah. to chat them up. Chop, chop up, up a conversation. Okay. Uh-huh. Jennifer mm-hmm. Lopez, the cell. Go ahead. Chop it up with them. You want to chop with it up them. with them? Yes. yes. There we go. You guys okay, great. Got what I was trying <laughs> just, to say. Yeah. I just wanted to say it. Like some yes. E forty slang. Yeah. But I, I once again, I think I was also. M- way hornier than Blake too. Like mm. I didn't want to just play the video games. Mm. I wanted to talk with the girls, but I was also crippled during this time yeah, of my life. Right. So right. at this time, That's right. no, the girls didn't want to this is the way. make out or smoke cigs yeah. with the guy, Sad. the kid in the wheelchair. Mm-hmm. Sorry it was hard to that. sneak out yeah, and, and that. do that stuff. So what would happen is my buddy Ryan would come in and always he would always stick his fingers in my face. <laughs> <laughs> Your face? <laughs> oh, what? Yeah, dude. Oh. That was it would, his like, okay. charity, his make a wish. You're like, just let me there, smell. Yeah, I wow. think it was. I know I didn't want to smell. I wasn't like trying to smell, but he but would always come up and be like, "Not bad, huh?" No, I actually thought it was way gross smelling. Well, how long <laughs> later? It been it's on like it was up like, his own ass. <laughs> <laughs> uh, for sure. This is an episode of Workaholics where Kyle puts his fingers in his butt and makes me smell them. Right? That could be. Oh yeah. Uh, well, yeah. Yeah. Right. What was that was episode? That? God, that is so gross. Uh, the darkness. <laughs> Yeah, and you smell them, and you're like, it actually smells Ooh, good. Nice. And I say, psych, yeah. <laughs> that shit was in my butt. Yeah. And then you have a nice, oh. you have a nice like wine flub that we just ended the episode on. Yeah, bullet. Oh, a powered through, power through wine flubs, baby. That was named after a girl that lived in our apartment complex. The darkness. Do you remember that. The darkness. The darkness. Yeah, she was yeah. Just yeah. A, she, a hot emo girl, right? That was the thing. She was c- not really that hot, but <laughs> a girl. She was a girl, though. <laughs> but she was a girl. <laughs> emo. Yeah. She was a girl and would wear all all black. Sh- yeah, she was a fun. But she was a party animal. She was fun. Yeah, she was cool. <laughs> yeah. Uh, and we called her the darkness, and I always thought that was a fun name. She had really obviously like um, dyed hair. Her hair was definitely not natural. Oh yeah, it was. It was so black, <laughs> so obvious. Well, it was so black, it was like almost purple. Yeah. You know how like when it, right. they dye like it, and it's too, it's too dark. Mm. Yes, <laughs> she looked like a raven. Yeah, the dar- hence the darkness. Uh, the raven. Right, the darkness, dark huh. eyeliner. And we cook all her raven, but that's Adam's uh, um, IMDb name, so, so it was already raven. taken. <laughs> <laughs> That's a raven. Damn, it's time oh, to revisit man. that one. Is, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, dude. Those, Got, those. Oh, guys, go ahead. I have uh, an Make announcement. You first. Uh-oh. Oh, shit. What up? Wait, hold on. Oh, oh. Uh, Blake, hit us with something. <laughs> what do we got? <laughs> COVID positive over here. No. Why? Oh. Oh. Why? Yeah. Why? 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 Yeah. Why? Oh Why? Kyle, Kyle, you've not had it, right? Uh, cause we're in the middle of a pandemic. 
I have not had it. No. Uh, well, not Boy, that I know. Oh, that's of. crazy. Dude. That is that's insane. so crazy. Blake, you have it. Have had. It. I ha- I got it on the Super Bowl. Yes, I had it. What you can hear? It was when we were all separated. We at the Super Bowl? No, no, I didn't get to go because. <laughs> Jesus, dude, dude, are you cool? Right yeah. Are yeah, you cool though? Long COVID, dude. I got the long COVID, <laughs> you, got, <laughs> you got the long haul. Oh no, God. I I got it right before the Super Bowl. I was hoping to go to it, but instead I just sat at home and. <laughs> Right, <laughs> fucking cried. And Adam's well documented to have it. Adam eight, has it three times. times. Yeah, have you? Are you three or two times? Because you got Delta and then I'm, the. I'm two. I'm two. I very much was expecting to get it in Italy because mm-hmm. we had finished. Each time I got it, it was at the very end of a production. Right. And then mm-hmm. I got it that next week. When your body mm. finally gives up. When your body is like fully, because as we've said before on the show, it's like when you do these productions, mm-hmm. you're working 14 hours a day and you just wear yourself down. And by the end of it, you end up getting sick mm-hmm. somehow. Yeah, because you're and putting up your defenses the whole time you're going because you're trying to push past to all the fucking yeah. exhaustion. Yeah, your du- your dukes are up. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, the whole time. Dukes are your up. Your dukes are huge. Your dukes are up. And then and then we got to Italy and, I'm, and I was kind of crossing my fingers. I'm like, fuck. Fuck, it'd be kind of sick to get it here. We had like a really <laughs> si- sweet room. I'm like, I'd hole up in this fucking pad for two weeks. Mm-hmm. Sure. Just some nice pasta, right. like some happy honeymoon. spritz. Yeah. Wait. Uh, but didn't get it. So yeah, I'm twice. Has anybody got it? I would love to have some like uh, incorrect information. Has anybody ever got it three times? Is it possible, or is COVID a two and done? Absolutely. For sure. Are there? Uh, I've never met a three-time gangster. I've met a three-time gangster. <laughs> Damn. Uh, they got they got the very, very first wave. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Uh, like before that we even really knew what COVID was. It was so like those tight. first few weeks. Right. And then they got Delta and then they got Omicron. the first Omicron. <laughs> Who's Damn. got the, So, Durs, do you have the dot BA2 or what's up, bro? What do you got, baby? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what I have. I assume I have the one that like doesn't really matter because all I've had is just kind of like, it doesn't matter. <laughs> I had 48 hours of like a little cough. Other than that, Wait, when did you get it? What day are we on? Because we're supposed to like go have a barbecue at your house. Yeah, aren't we, so- aren't we trying to have a barbecue? Yeah, I know, I know. I'm I'm gonna test on Thursday to see if that's still on. Otherwise, yeah, dang, dude, we're, we're and well, I gotta see who else in my family. Uh, they've been testing, and yeah, 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 yeah. Damn, dude. Oh, because you just went. You just went on that batch party. That's where you got it from, huh? That's oh, you got it in Vegas. Oh, yeah, 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 Vegas. Yes. Yeah. Vegas, baby. Damn. It would, you got a you got a Vegas baby. Yeah. Well, even if you're if you're not doing it or if you are, what happens in Vegas gives you COVID. I'm still coming down to LA for a couple of weeks and leaving on Friday. Coming down. You want co- you want COVID? Yeah, yeah, I'd love it. Uh, <laughs> I'll be over first thing on Friday, right when we land. Um, yeah. <clears throat> but I actually was thinking, like, dude, should we get together and do a fucking in person pod? Is everybody like? <laughs> Oh my I mean, God. I don't. I, I know. Normally, we talk about this <laughs> off, thing sucks. whatever. But like, but like, should we do this? I'm gonna be down there. Let's fucking get together and pot it up. Sure, that'd be a fucking <laughs> yeah. sick butt If you're gonna dude. make me, fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm kind of cool. doing we'll do that right now at the barbecue. We'll just take the well, first would... hour and hang out. Oh my God! Let's just like test uh, different like new chip flavors and stuff. That'll be fun to do in person. Yeah, I'd be down for that. <laughs> yeah, let's producers. Have we talked about doing anything in person? Um, Shut up, bitch. We talked about like smelling each other's butts or something like that. Or yeah, we everything. Smell Adam's jizz for yeah, sure. We, oh, oh, I for sure will bring I would a, love I you. will. I will bring a jar of my jizz <laughs> and let sure. everyone smell it. No, it needs uh, to be fresh. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> well, I, I'll do it in the car. I'm not saying that I'm not going to keep it for a long time. <laughs> not in the car. You're going to walk out of the podcast and you're going to walk back in. And I'll be late for that. You got to do it at a church lock-in and then come straight <laughs> okay. to my house. Yeah. Damn. I'll go to my nearest church lock-in mm. and... Uh, <laughs> Hit up a sleeping oh, I, bag. I drunkenly pr- uh, crashed a prom the other night. <laughs> oh, I thought you should say tr- crash your car. Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, what a bummer. Fuck it. Where? Where at yeah, prom? Uh, it was in uh, Newport. It was like I just got back, and we were taking the boat out, and uh, me and, and uh, Zach and, and Chelsea, our good yeah, friends, yeah. and Chloe were uh, taking the little Delphi about, and then we we stopped in and saw, saw that there was a party, and they're getting married at uh, at this venue that we saw from the water, and there was a- Who's they? Who's they? Oh, Zach and Chelsea. Are. Zach, and, Zach and Chelsea. Right, oh, right, right. copy. And, 
And so they, we were like, oh, there's a, f- there is a wedding happening right now. Let's go look to see how they did it. Mm. And we were, at first, we were very drunk. And we were like, man. <laughs> you just oh did it. Let's see how. Kids are getting, kids are getting married <laughs> so young nowadays. Right. Adam, you're driving the boat. Right. <laughs> I was driving the boat. <laughs> They're getting married so young nowadays. <laughs> And then we walk inside, and then it was just like you know, it's a high. It was a high Builder. school prom. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty that's cool. cool. Did you dance? Did you dance about a little bit? No, it became like a little bit of a photo booth where I'm just taking photos with mm. a with a ton of right. kids in sparkly dresses. Right. And then and then I was uh, Chelsea, who is going to be the bride in like a week and a half, was like. We have to get the fuck out of here. I don't want to get COVID. And I'm like, that's probably a good <laughs> right. call. Uh-huh. I'm like, I forgot that that is still exists. Yeah, yeah. When you go, hate COVID. When, you're getting, when you crash a high school prom um, uh-huh. and you're with other people and you start taking photos, don't you go like, okay, I'm going to. I'm gonna go leave. <laughs> no, he right. was drunk. <laughs> yeah, uh, he no, was I loving was, it. I was ready to. Right. I was ready to throw down. Yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah. No, it it all happened. It, we were in and out within five ten mm-hmm. minutes. It, okay. it it was a very quick t- uh, quick turnaround. Mm-hmm. There wasn't there was no like dancing. Adam doing this. No, as soon as Adam realized minors were present, he the tornado. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. No, I didn't get a bus out the tornado. It was right at the end. People were sort of starting to filter out. I think. I think they had just were just wrapping up. Right. They were yeah. going to drink uh, um, vodka in Snapple bottles. Yeah, they were about to go fuck up some hypnotic and shit. That would be sweet. Mm. Yeah, they were. It also reeked of weed. I was like, "There's some bad boys in this crew mm. smoking weed at the prom." That's well, don't bold. you? Yeah. How old it's do you have to be here. to fucking? How old do you have to be to smoke weed? Is it eighteen or twenty one? It's got to be twenty one, right? Yeah. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh. Yeah, I believe so. That Game. sucks. I'm sorry to all the 19 and 20 year olds Dude, out there. Yeah. Sucks. Yeah, you can sign up for the army and get murdered, but you can't can't light up a dube. You said it. Wow, you can give your life for the flag, but you can't smoke a you doobie. You said it. God you said damn. It. Yeah, that's that is wackadoodle. Okay, let's well, reevaluate that one. Okay. Here's my question: If Trump wins in 2024, okay, Paul let's charge, go. Man. Po charge. All right. He does these two? Here he things. goes, Polly charge. What do you think? Yeah. Have? He comes back and he changes. He reverses the drinking and smoking age to 18. Okay, that does nothing for me, but yeah, that would do n- zero for but me. But do, don't okay. you think that's fucking rad? Yeah, I'd be actually pissed. <laughs> I do think it's actually fucking. I would want some retroactive stuff because I missed that boat. Like if if you're going for the young vote and you change it to 18, aren't you going to win in a landslide, right? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, you you, well, right. for sure he's doing that then. And then what if he also <laughs> changed the? He went to the metric system, and everybody was like, "Oh fuck." Nah, that's some British shit. I know, but that's what I'm saying is that it would be very confusing if he did it. Mm, so you're saying, oh, dude, I was wait, so confused. Wait, what is this hypothetical? He he changes the drinking smoking age to 18, <laughs> and transfers us to the metric system. So you're so if you're a kid, you're kind of stoked, but then you're also like, I don't know how many liters goes into my gas tank. Yeah. I, I don't think kids confused. would give a fuck about the. I don't think kids would give a fuck about the metric system. I think they would just be like. I feel like uh, the people. I would say like <laughs> if Joe Biden said we're gonna change it to the metric system, civil war would start, right? But if Trump, you're not did that it, guy, pal. Trust me. Everyone would just be like, <laughs> "Fuck." Okay, uh, he's <laughs> right. We do want it. It is better because well, the metric system. It's so much simpler, dude. It's so much simpler. It's very... Is it? Yes. Yes. It's tens and hundreds. It's points. It's point oh, point one. It's It's very simple. It's so good. Yeah. Why is it so good? I just dealt with it. I just... Bro, you're not dealing with quartz. I just dealt with it for three plus months. Yeah. And I, I didn't really like it. Thank you. Thank you, Adam, for standing up for our... Our system, whatever Listen, it's called. Well, wait, but what the fuck do you actually? But do you have a dog in the race? Do you actually care if about inches versus centimeters? Does he have a dog in the race? <laughs> I'm sure as like much a, as you do. I'm talking. I'd rather talk about <laughs> what are you measuring inches than talk about quarter <laughs> centimeters. No, I, I. Well, for me, I was like, what are you measuring? What are you cooking? And what are you doing that where this affects your life? I was, the, it was gas, it was gas. Gasoline. Well, I kept going Gallons. past the the, ga, the gas stations, mm-hmm. and I'm going, God damn, gas is cheap as fuck here. It was like a $1.70, <laughs> uh, and I'm like, this is cheap as shit, dude. Mm-hmm. Uh, and then I found out it's quartz. 
Right. Oh, or, shit. Or quarters. leaders. It's actually it's leaders. leaders. <laughs> it's leaders. It's leaders. Yeah. It's leaders. a quart is a it's part of. Yeah. <laughs> a quart is a part of. So, so, yes, Adam, if you don't know that something. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's leaders. And I think it's like three leaders and some change. <laughs> You're right about that. If you haven't thought one second about it. Yeah, I know I'm right. I know I'm right about that. It's a little yeah. confusing. Because uh, quartz, quartz and pints are a part of the gallon system, right? Which is not liters. Yeah, the gallon system. <laughs> Whatever that system <laughs> yeah. is. Are yeah. we the only one that people that use gallons? I'm not a smart man. I think so. I think it the inches and the gallons. <laughs> yeah, and the inches oh, and the miles, uh, the inches and the miles and the miles and the boogers. Yeah, <laughs> that yeah. shit's important. Yeah. And the hemis. <laughs> It's fucking it's, millimeter, centimeter, meter, kilometer, dude. like that shit. It's yeah. fucking right. good. Let's let's quit <laughs> acting like we even need to know this yeah, shit, dude. Man. Who gives a shit? No, dude. I know an inch is two point five four centimeters. Get at me. Get at me. I know what it, I know what six inches is. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, think about if you measured your dick in if you inches? measured your dick in centimeters, you'd have a bigger number, baby. How how big is my dick in the yeah. metrics? Yeah, that's true. Adam, where you at now? <laughs> you'd have a bigger number. Uh, I might have came around on it. Uh, did you also know that uh, that I yeah I spent you know that time in Germany? I know. Yep. Yeah. Yes. Well yes, Adam. Yes. I thought everyone was going to be on the driving on the right hand side but oh. only england does that shit That's only right. Br british oh really yes. yeah well i think british and then some asian countries do it too right yeah japan I, yeah yeah really i thought everybody did that and i've been to italy no they don't do that in italy italy's italy's on the on our side of the road on the same yeah, side on the right side yeah. yes wait germany germany is on the, the, right, the right side yes yeah. Yes. Just wow. Why do they even do that? Like, where did where did that happen? But you're also talking about the steering wheel on the other side too. Some king said this is the way it's got to be. And then in a, in the United States, we just said we're gonna do whatever the fucking is the opposite of the king. Like, fuck it, we're driving on the other side. You could suck our dick. Well, they didn't have cars back then, Playboy. Uh, yeah. Bro, bro, bro. This was way before cars, homeboy. Yes, but it was <laughs> it, it was horse and buggy. It was Wells it was Wells Fargo day, you bitch. <laughs> Wells Fargo era. <laughs> you wouldn't even know your grandma was by the fucking river. Bro, she didn't even have a carriage, okay? She was walking. And no brassiers. And I'm not shaving yeah, my you? pits. <laughs> Hold up. None of them were. Yeah, they didn't have razors. They didn't have fucking razors. When did when did women start shaming armpits? Because fifties. It's pretty great. The twenties. It's a good look. Twenties, thirties, fifties. Whenever they started selling razors, bro. You, you just say every say every decade. Mm -hmm. I think it was during <laughs> World War One when they. When the men went away, the razor companies invented like shaving body hair for women, right? To make money. Is that right? Um, I mean, that's a great guess. Mm. That's an excellent. I think that was the whole thing. They were just like, hey, while your dudes are away, just start like shaving your body. Why not? And then should we talk about this? <laughs> what? At what? 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 In, uh, at what point in the nineties? Twenties. Did it become? No, I'm sorry. What time? What? What point in the nineties? And what was it because of porno that women were like, now we gotta shave our pussies? Let's yeah. go. <laughs> and, and, <laughs> we got to shave, like. Yep. Thank you, Durs. <laughs> Thank you. No, but, but honestly, that's super recent. That's very, very recent. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Durs. No, you're right. You're right, and that's probably just like <laughs> that. That, that the, if you talk to anybody ten years older Thank than you. us, they're like. Guess what, man? I mean, I think David Spade even went into it on, on his stand-up special where he's like, when I was in high school, it was like an airbag went off in a chick's underwear because it was just like, um, right. Yeah. Yeah. But that's like that's new. <laughs> yeah, well, in the, yeah, when you speak of like society in general, yeah, it well, is a new phenomenon. Well, we're like, when did they start shaving their legs? Like, well, here, we have our own thing that we watched yeah. happen. Hey, when they start shaving the pussy, I think this is in the Cat Williams special. That happened. Dude, that happened on our watch, man. Yeah, that's on our watch. Thank you, Adam. <laughs> yeah. Thank you, God. Our um, generation you, did God. that. The, gr <laughs> the greatest generation. The greatest generation. <laughs> and what the fuck happened? 
<laughs> what was the uh, thing? What was it like? This is kind of what you got to do now. It's shame, bro. It's shame in body hair. That started mm. in the 20s when they started. That's what they're saying. Like they started. Who's they? Is this in the comment? Is this? They started shaving. Uh, this is in the this is in the comments. It's saying in the 1920s, sleeveless women dresses were increasingly becoming more mm. popular. Mm. Fashion. Mm, uh -huh. <laughs> Thank God. Fashion was the first instance that women that made women begin it's science uh, shaving their hair, <laughs> okay. thus God, removing the hair. Un well, it's not written. Look at that. It's not written right. <laughs> thus, removing the hair underarms became. <laughs> it's not written right. Became a priority. <laughs> this is like an ad read. Where did you pull this is that crazy. from? I need like a. Oh my God! <laughs> that was, it is. It's, that was better than an ad read, though. <laughs> so they were shaving their arms, but the thing is, like now they don't shave their arms at all. As as far as I know. Well, now they're 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 some, <laughs> they're going back. Why would you? Now they're going back to be like, why? Because it was it was just for sales, right? It was just they sold razors, so they said you need to do it. Right. Right. <laughs> and then everybody felt like they had to, so then everybody did it, and now it's and right. then it transferred to the vaginas, the and then it kept going. It's like a yeah. virus. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's also it's yeah, you know. I mean, I feel like for the most part, uh, <laughs> it's sexier to have the hair or what? It's preference. You were programmed to think that for uh, less hair. It's just okay because you know if you're down there, if you're looking, I feel like maybe there wasn't a lot of. If you're looking, looking. <laughs> if you're looking, if you're looking, you're looking. You're not that guy. Bill. There's Trust not me. a lot of. Uh, Cunnilingus back in the 20s. I bet maybe they really started to uh, winning. Dude, well, that's true. Haven't you ever seen Deadwood? They were eating box all day out there. <laughs> okay. Were they? Wells Fargo? Okay, but then they're getting hairs all in their in their mouths during the Wells Fargo days. You know, during the Wells Fargo days. Yeah, but they didn't give a fuck. Why did we start caring? Yeah. Kyle shaves his nuts. There is a certain amount of sexual hygiene that can be, you know, that I think we should uphold uh, in our world. But you, you're going to be the poster boy for that. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> this is going to find out Kyle's been waxing his asshole. Although I yeah. did say I would get my butthole lasered if we went three seasons of Workaholics because I was like, yeah, what happened there? I don't know. I, I guess um, you got scared. The dream died. You let the dream yeah. die. <laughs> Maybe that's what we should do live and in person. I got busy. I got too busy. I'm not that guy. Pal. Hey, you're ne it's never too late. When we're live and in person, can you be what, lasering your butthole when we do our live pod? <laughs> Dude, Can we be no, right when there? We do our, when we do a live tour and we're at okay. the Fillmore right. in Detroit, and I Ooh. want Durs to get his butthole lasered <laughs> on like, stage. Like curtain, I'm just like yes. out of a curtain, like those like those videos we know. That'd be so great. Oh my god! Where it's just like you can't see behind me, but I'm like. <laughs> <laughs> and you I hear it, we have it mic'd up. People listening and it's bro it's got COVID. This guy got COVID. Any, anytime you hear that, that's when it gets a hair. So it's just <laughs> yoink. It's <laughs> chopping a forest down. For me, it's not that long. I'm not a hairy guy. <laughs> but how long is it to get your uh, eyes lasered? What is that process? It's 15 minutes. Damn, in and out. Yeah, burger. Uh -huh. LASIK. Does it well, work? Remember, LASIK wanted to <laughs> no. give us. Uh, Doesn't it not work? Isn't it shit? No. What do you Isn't no, early LASIK great. shit? Oh, I thought. Did no, you have to redo your it. LASIK? I thought. Of you course had to... I did. So. <laughs> <laughs> of course I, I did. It. Why? It, I think ten years later I had to do it, and I'm creeping up on ten more years. So. But we'll see. but that seems like a proper amount of time to 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 be able to see ten years. Yeah, it's a great deal to just cook parts of your eyeball off so you can see better. Yeah. 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 No yeah, way. I don't. I'm not scared of that. Really. I. It feels like it's such a normal procedure that I. I think. I, I wonder would... if you can get both done at the same time. Wait. You did one. You could, did. You only get one. No. No. I'm sorry. Laser your eyes and, and your, your asshole. asshole. And your asshole. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh. That's called the cat dog, baby. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I know exactly why, and I don't. Doo -doo. <laughs> Was it cat dog? You got a cat on one side and a dog on yeah, the other side. That's right. <laughs> I'm here yeah. for a cat dog. Right this way, sir. Come, come, come through this curtain. Put your head. Come through right this over here. Oh, yeah. They put you between. It looks like, <laughs> looks like a James Bond movie back there. <laughs> they just so got doctor, a laser. Are you the up front or uh, but down bottom? <laughs> like, I'm damn, down bottom are, boy. You can tell the difference like, right away. Like you're the butthole guy. <laughs> Oh, and you're the butthole He's guy. here for the Dude, butthole for sure. I was thinking about this today. What, like, the fact that... Do, like, okay. 
What for, up? For <laughs> decades, for year, hundreds of years, maybe there were dude gynecologists. Like how? Very the shaggy. F- they're yeah, still. There I mean, still, still is, are, right? But like, for yeah. by and large, if you're a woman at this point, like there are do- like thousands of <laughs> female gynecologists. You're gonna go see them. Yeah. For sure. Right. Yeah. yeah. That that, that, that is fucking mostly. nuts, dude. So that's a <laughs> being yeah. in, in med school. I mean, like, so what are you gonna do? Uh, but podiatrist. I'm gonna be a. Uh, uh, Doctor for kids, mm-hmm. and then the guy is pediatrician. like, yeah. I'm a gynecologist." Like, yeah, or is it like a? Like, it's always got to be like, of course he's gonna be a gynecologist. Yeah. Or well, were you the guy who was like, "Oh, for sure, I'm a good dude. I gotta do this, or some other creep's gonna do it." That is a great question. Uh, I'd say eight out of ten. Yeah. Like, how did that work? Yeah, like, do you kind of naturally? Eight out of creep. ten were creeps. Yes, There's two out right. of those ten that were the good dudes. Yes. Okay, eight out of ten. If that's what you go... So, to me, that sounds like the worst, because it's... No. You yeah, see you're, not looking at, like, right. you're not yeah. looking at, yeah. like, the cream of the crop. <laughs> no, but yes, yes, you are. Well, even if you are, uh, even... Well, sure, but you're also looking at literal cream <laughs> of the crop. <laughs> Oh, wow. But well, guess what? That might be somebody's thing. <laughs> yeah. Hachi manchi. What, is, what was it? Blue waffles? Or waffles out! <laughs> yeah, you are, you are seeing some blue waffles up but, in the business. Like, what? I, it's just a Imagine fucking weird nightmares. thing to be like. Yeah, that is that is super Dude, wild. that's just a great question. Uh, I'm gonna be a gynecologist. And and there was that's be, uh, yeah, that's nuts, dude. There was no women in like med school. You know, what well, next time you come here, you might want to I don't know. But also that is thing. <laughs> <laughs> and, yeah, yeah. That's what but, happened. Yeah, also, he's selling did, razors. How many doctors go like I guess I don't know cuz I Dr. Shit. There's no way I would ever be a doctor cuz I'm dumb as fuck, but like do you go into uh, the medical please. like medical school? Being like, I want to be this kind of doctor, or do you like study and you see what tests you're kind of like excelling at? I'm sure it's case by case. Um, and this dude's like, wow, I'm like really knowledgeable about the vagina. I can just remember the parts very well. I've just got a knack for uh, <laughs> poontang. Um, yeah, I don't know. I was just thinking because of the end of Animal House, it like says what they're doing, an otter, it says like gynecologist Beverly Hills, California. And it's like, because he's got it made. And you're like, well, Creepy. <laughs> you know, like, right. Oh, but, okay. But also looking back, I'm like, yeah, I guess he is the kind of guy that would do that. Um, so there, we're saying, seeing in the chat that you do rotations during med school, and then and this is interesting stuff. <laughs> you got a knack for vagina, Clark. <laughs> and then you do residency, and you and you figure out what you specialize in on your third or fourth year of med school. <laughs> then you start to specialize. Which makes sense. Oh, you know what it is? Here's the red flag. <laughs> and I did not know that. <laughs> I, bet, I, I bet this is the red flag. Where the guy who's, he won't stop talking about how he's like, I just feel like I'm good at the gynecology stuff. They're like, uh, okay. okay. You nah, know what? I think we're going to have you on. You're going to stick with broken arms. Dermatology. <laughs> yeah. The yeah. ripping and the tearing. Any guy who keeps talking about how they're just like, yeah, I don't know what it is. I just feel Dude, like it's I'm just weird. I was born yeah. to do this. They're like, mm. it's weird. I'm just excelling at this. Why don't you come up over here and look at this brain real quick? <laughs> yeah, brain's right. <laughs> <laughs> Brain. Brain looks good. <laughs> Brain's right. Brain looks good, Chuck. <laughs> looks good, man. <laughs> Milton. What um what kind of doctors do you think we would be? Oh. Uh, oh. Kyle? I, Kyle, what do you think? I think, think, what do think, you think I know what I would like to be. I said yeah. spinacologist. Right off the top of the dome, I'm orthopedic. Mm-hmm. Your your feet? Yeah, man. Oh, that's tight. Yeah. Orthopedic is no. not feet, is it? That's bones. Orthopedic is bones. Oh, yes. yeah, you're a podiatrist. <laughs> So and that that is what uh, <laughs> I, I believe I would be an orthopedic surgeon as well, just because of all of my my knee surgeries. I think I would uh, I would go that way. Also, all the <laughs> orthopedic been drawn guys, to it or something? all the orthopedic guys are are tight. They're like the the jocks, the dumb jocks <laughs> of the uh, right. Yeah, that is true of the medical profession. All those OC orthopedic surgeons. Yeah, yeah. yeah. My buddy There's... Bill was telling me about the guy who like gave him a new uh, neck bone or something like that. He was like, nice. I'll give you a bone. He's just a super handsome bro who pulled up in like a Ferrari, worked on him for two hours and was like, whoosh, whoosh, with the gloves and then just pieced out to go golf. And uh, I assume 
fuck hella chicks in the sand trap. Yeah. They yeah. must have the most uh, um, custom license plates, like Bones with a Z. Yeah. That shit, it goes. <laughs> yeah. Right. Right, yeah, they must. They have yeah. to. Doctor Bones, Big Bone, uh, so surgeon. Dude, so the boat oh. that I bought during G-I-N. the Bone Collector, the boat that yeah, I bought yeah. during the pandemic. Mm -hmm. uh, the name of it, because you know how every bone, uh, every uh, boat is named. It's yes. called Good Good Bones. Good because bones. Because oh, it was an orthopedic surgeon. Oh, okay. Good Bones. Oh, okay. Yeah. See, Big Blake, you're onto something. Blake, you're going. Are you saying orthopedic, or what are you? What are you saying? You wanted. You're a podiatrist, right? Is that what you were saying? <laughs> How'd you know <laughs> I meant the foot <laughs> doctor? <laughs> did you mean the foot doctor? Yeah, I did. did. You know, I, I have a feeling that that is like the lowest of the low. Like they aren't respected, right? Yeah, you smell. Why? There's a ton of bones in the in the feet. Why are they not? But we're not talking about bones anymore. We're just talking about <laughs> yeah. Period. You're obsessed ah. with bones. <laughs> You're obsessed with bones. Dude, you should be an ortho. <laughs> Whoa, no, that's pretty cool, actually. There's a lot of bones in there. There's tons of bones in the feet, my friend. <laughs> I would love to talk to you about feet someday. Why feet, Blake? Are you... I could see Blake being a, a, like a weird little feet guy. You like uh -huh. to suck toes? What's going on over there? <laughs> <laughs> What's um, up? Toe suck toe. Ow. I don't know that I l like it. I don't... Oh. I like, that doesn't bother me. Yeah. Sucking okay. toes. All right. I don't know. I'd say so now. Wait, hold on. You said you don't know if you like it, but it doesn't bother you. Yeah. What's the deal? What's up, brother? Uh -huh. okay. <laughs> and you went there. I just like I'm a very generous lover. Like whatever you ask of me, I shall. <laughs> <laughs> I can get behind sure. that. I think that's sure. a very noble yeah. answer. Good job, bud. Yeah, I don't yeah. come in with like a checklist. You know what I mean? It just right. whatever happens, happens. I'm an improviser. I think you that's know? most people. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I, think, I, think, I think some people come with a checklist. Okay, brother. I think you're right. Yeah, <laughs> with a check, check please. Checklist. Check, please. Yeah, some people are just like, "That's it." Okay, good. Later, other people are in it to play jazz. They're in it for the session. Uh, yeah, you know? we're a little jazz. <laughs> we do the jazz. Yeah, we we're, we're, we're <laughs> the jazz. Jazzes are the best, bro. That's we're jasmine over. Uh, yeah. yeah, we're jasmine over here at uh, isn't it? <laughs> Is. Adam just re Adam just renamed our podcast to Isn't It Important? <laughs> the Isn't It Important? It's like a musical now. <laughs> isn't it important? Isn't it important? <laughs> <laughs> oh, he musical caught it. He caught, his shit caught a tube. He didn't spit uh, though. His shit yeah, caught I a spit tube. everywhere. Dude. Oh, you I did spit everywhere. It's all over my wife's phone. I got it. Isn't funny. it important? Oh, isn't it important? So, Kyle, you're a child doctor. <laughs> no, no, no. I think I, I'm, I'm. I'm looking at either brain brain surgeon, herbal remedies, if you know what I mean. Brain surgery. Last oh. thing I want is you touching my brain, uh, son or, of a bitch, yeah, yeah, or dentist. Allowed. Yeah, right. <laughs> that doesn't count. Yeah, yeah, but but do you have good teeth? Okay, then I'll do both. Oh, uh, we're about to have dentists on our ass. No, dentists are doctors. That's of true. Course, yeah, yeah, of course, of yeah. course. But uh, yeah. do you have good teeth, Kyle? No, horrible teeth. So, <laughs> yeah, but I love. So. Let me see your teeth up close. I always thought Very you had pretty good nice. teeth. What's wrong? Freaking with you? see ya. <laughs> I mean, you look like uh, the violator from Spawn, but it's fine to me. <laughs> you, this bro's teeth friends. looks like Todd McFarlane drew him. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> Such a deep reference. No, that's a great one. Uh -huh. uh, you know what I mean? Smiling over here like John Leguizamo. <laughs> yeah, no. <laughs> they're important. I always yeah. like when I go to the dentist. Isn't it important? <laughs> yeah, I like going learning on? about it. I you have to get, them, dude. Right? I, you know what they? Yeah, those teeth look, those teeth look fine. Yeah, I think they look good. I gotta yep. get Invisalign for your bottom row. Yeah, I think they're gonna have to pull one. Bitch, you got too many teeth in your mouth, <laughs> dude. They're gonna pull one because it's all fucking dude. crunched down there. I got the Will Ferrell yeah. bottom grill. I'm, uh, I'm starting to have that, that same thing up top. I used to have a gap in my teeth, and now it's, it's pushing in, and there's no, there's no gap, and I'm afraid they're gonna start to go whip. There goes mm. your personality, and get all, get all wonky. I know. Mm. Yeah, yeah. My Everyone's gonna be like, gone. "Look at that hot fucking dude who's not funny." Uh, yeah, what the uh, fuck? He's not funny anymore. Yeah, where did his uh, gap go? Mm -hmm. He used to be a gap. I mean, Jamie Foxx got rid of his, so he's still funny. He had one. Yeah, then he got those Ninja Turtle dogs put in, like me. Damn. Yeah, but <laughs> yeah, but he's, he's so Spoon sexy curve. though, with he's a hairline true. down to his uh, eyeballs. Yeah. <laughs> That guy, that, ki that hairline keeps getting lower and lower every time I see mm -hmm. that guy. Mm -hmm. What about you, Durs? What kind of doctor are you? 
I'm the What's one they call Doctor Feel Good. Uh, <laughs> oh, <laughs> um, I'd probably be like a plastic surgeon that like takes little <laughs> yeah. burn victims yeah. and like, puts a face on them. You know? <laughs> oh shit! A uh, bear attacks? Yeah, but also titties though. Uh, let's not. Yeah, but also fix titties. Yeah, also titties. Well, you got to pay the bills. Uh, <laughs> I know. I do only calf implants. Okay. Yeah, I could see you specializing in something niche like that. It'd be fucking yeah. <laughs> real top notch. I mean, look, all I'll say is that laser eye surgery, the doctor who did mine in like 2003 originally had like a nice office. And then when I went back 10 years later, he had the fucking nicest office I've ever seen a doctor have in Beverly Hills on Rodeo Drive. And I was like, oh, this dude's been working. And all he does... I think it was like they only operate on Tuesdays and Thursdays and he Fuck. just does like 40 a day because they take 15 minutes and he just goes back and forth, kills it. Oops, See, winning. And that's, why, and that's why we hope all the doctors get into the business is to make yeah. money. That's why they're into it now, dude. You know, yeah. not to not to help people, not to to save lives. or. That's what it is. Just to, you know, get that well, office. Would you be an ER doctor, Kyle? Do you like that kind of rush? Yeah. Ooh, dude, that's a... I think, yeah, I think I would like that. Yeah. I think I would dig that. Yeah, where it's... You'd be like the wacky... Adam would be uh, Robin Williams with that nose on. Patch Adams. <laughs> yeah. Oh, Patch Adams. <laughs> yeah. Damn, dude. Uh -huh. Yeah. I, I would like to be like an ER doctor. Do, do they have ER... Doctors at children's hospitals. That I think that would be very for sure rewarding. That would be so scary. That yeah, you have children's yeah, but, lives in your hand. Yeah, but then you get to save kids' lives every day. You get to be like, oh mm -hmm. yeah, some crazy Hopefully. shit happened, and I yeah. But the one you don't is gonna haunt your nightmares. Ooh, no, cool then, pilot idea. <laughs> oh shit. Cool pilot idea. You didn't save me. I'm going to be right here the whole time now. Oh, that's kind of tight. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to stick with the feet, dude. I'm going to stick with the foot doctor. Yeah, we know We know you will. Mm -hmm. We know you will. <laughs> I don't got a tail sucker. <laughs> <laughs> Burning off uh, warts and shit. Have you guys ever had a, a wart on your toes? I have. Yeah. No. I've had, I have, yes. Isn't that cool when you get the, the Band-Aid cool? and you put it on and like it yes. kills the skin around it and then the wart just rolls off? Slowly, like. Hmm. It like eats away at it. Isn't this important? <laughs> uh, I used to have them on my dick. Any uh, take backs, apologies? <laughs> I guess we have reached. Wait, that what time. did he just say? <laughs> I didn't hear anything. I'm gonna have to go back. I'm gonna listen well, back. Whatever a, Adam just can said. Can we turn that back up? What do you say? Yeah. You hit the 15 second back button on that. Any uh, take backs, apologies? Any? Uh... <laughs> yeah. That's life. Uh -huh. Epic uh -huh. slams. Uh What's he talking uh, about? He has a, <laughs> some about a pronounced ridge. Yeah, about that. Planter's word on his nutsack. What's yeah. going on? Uh, I guess I'll give a I'll guess I'll give a special shout out to Anders for enduring COVID and getting on the Zoom, man. Yeah. You're a trooper, dude. That's huge. I you mean, I'm here in lockdown in my office. There's a bed in here. It's I'm kind of locked down here. You don't feel bad, bad, huh? No, yeah. I've been like working out and oh, uh, great. yeah, doing doing my thing, trying to stay positive. I like that. Uh, I like that. Well, well yeah, negative. you want to get negative. Yeah, yeah. Positive's yeah. not the way to be, yeah. but. Oh, go I'd ahead. be a COVID doctor. I guess I would be Dr. <laughs> Fauci. Oh, hey, yeah. Hey, okay. Be... <laughs> That's my guy. <laughs> Dead ringer. If I could be any Fauci. good doctor. Dead ringer. Let's go. Dead ringer. <laughs> That's my dead ringer. <laughs> Let's go. Beautiful. Oh, I like that one, Blake. Thank you. Uh, you know, you know what? On a, hey, guys, on a serious note, I'm glad it's not that bad, and I hope no one else catches it from me. Mm -hmm. On a very serious note. Yes. Dude, you know why? Thank you for being poly charged. Isn't this important? <laughs> Isn't, Isn't it important? <laughs> Um, I, any take backs? Yeah, I'm trying yeah. to think of take backs. Did I say some dumb shit? Maybe you guys can. Uh... You said a lot. Of, you guys said a lot of dumb shit, and I have it all written down Whoa. right here. But I'm not going to tell you. <laughs> what did I say that was super dumb? Yeah, I may or may not have said some shit right at the end uh, that I wish I could take back, but uh, I'm not. Planters not gonna, I'm let it fly. Oh, Planters no. word on your nutsack. Can I say uh, something? Knows? During this whole, I mean, none of us can really grow like a fantastic beard. Kyle, yours is fine, but like, <laughs> I'm glad none of us got Perfect. caught up, caught up in that, something. that beard era that just happened the last five years where it's like hmm. so manicured. Do you, you know what I'm talking about? Because I'm just designer beard. Yeah, like, I want to. I want to shave my shit off. I'm sick of it. Well, what was the the beard era? Did that go hand in hand with like craft beer? I yeah, feel like kinda... those. It did. Yeah, it's a yeah. craft beard. 
actually. It's a craft yeah. beard. Yeah. Yeah. I feel yeah. like none of us got that deep into craft. I think that's the only reason you said it. <laughs> uh, none of us got that deep into craft beer. So, you know, we, right. we couldn't. We couldn't. Yeah. yeah. We weren't allowed. I think we've rid the line of like smoking weed and drinking beer the right way where we didn't like de- dive mm. too deep into the actual like culture of it. So shout out to us for being great yeah. <laughs> addicts. For being, for being tourists. We're basically yeah. just tourists who don't get into anything and just want to stay drunk. Yeah, yeah. I, we stay drunk and, and stay high, but uh, but we're not going to be too deep in okay. the culture. We don't, we don't want to know exactly how it's made or like that's right. the best. I didn't grow dreads. Adam didn't grow a beard. Shout out to us. That's my shout out. Yeah. I don't think I can grow a beard. I honestly... Like, a, I like a Bolzerian... But, but everyone, it's so <laughs> weird. No, the groomed beards are fucked. I don't know, man. I don't know. <laughs> I hate it. I keep getting the Instagram like groomed beards in my uh, discoveries. You know why? You look really nice, Kyle. What'd you say, Adam? You look really nice. You like it? Yeah. Why? Yeah. You look really why, nice. Blake? Uh, on the next, we'll cover it on the next one. <laughs> what? We, what happened down there? Next one. Next one of what? Next one of, of what? Isn't it important? <laughs> uh, well, I would like to. I would like to uh, give thanks for my group of friends who I'm hoping to see in person. I keep asking Blake to watch basketball. He keeps. Let's dodging do it today. Me. I can't today, dude. You did. Oh wow! My sister's gonna come over to have dinner. I know. I'm. I asked him multiple times last week, uh-huh. and, 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 and nothing. Not nothing. a great playoffs. Right? No, really dog shit NBA playoffs this But do this we year. think that the whoever the matchup is going to be, I mean, it's... The Warriors knows? are going to Warriors win. Warriors are going to sweep, it's, probably. From your mouth to God's ears. I, I thought I thought Dallas was their, their biggest shot of getting knocked off, and they're just handling them. And I think no matter who wins... The Celtics and Heat series, they're gonna they're gonna roll them. So I think congratulations. Celtics, Blake. right? You got we'll another. See. We'll see. Good for and, you. And Blake, are you going to go to a a game? We'll see. I'll put the feelers out for sure. If it happens, I'd right, love man. to. Yeah. Or maybe even put the money out, dude, and just go buy a We're ticket. Well, part of, the, part of the feelers is well, money. You, yeah. Nobody goes for free. Yeah. <laughs> just yeah, don't you, uh, overdraft, well, you just bro. Just overdraft Don't it, so overdraft, maybe, homie. I'm good. Maybe I'm not, good man. for it. <laughs> this is crazy. <laughs> maybe not, man. It. Maybe not. Just be cool about it. Check your shit. Check your shit before God. you click purchase, Lord. homeboy. I gotta like, check your numbers. Yeah, dang. All right, yeah. All right guys, that's another check your episode of it is it important. important. <laughs>